Shalom, Shalom, Israel, Shalom. This your brother. This your brother, Shopper. We wanted to come back in, get a quick lesson in before we get started. All praises be to the Most High Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rekah HaKwadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth, to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad. Unlikened to a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, greeting salutations to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom on, right? So, man, this place wicked as hell, man. So, this just came across, what's, a, what, what, what's his name? Rachel, <laughs> Rachel Levine confirmed to become the highest ranking openly, open, openly transgender official. Look, I, I was looking at these these pictures of this guy, man. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy, man. Let's great. Let's get some scriptures, man. This who they going to for their leadership and guidance? Hebrews chapter twelve, verse sixteen. Hebrews 12 and 16. Least there be any fornicator or profane person as Esau, who for one morsel of meat sold his birthright. For ye, not, ye know how that afterward, when he would have inherited the blessings, he was rejected, for he found no place of repentance, though he sought it carefully with tears. Yeah. Foul for the foul fornicator, man. Let's go first Corinthians. That made me think right there, made me think about um Revelation 18, chapter 18. Might get that. First Corinthians chapter 6, verse 9. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of the Most High, but not deceive neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusers of themselves with mankind. Yep, they ain't getting nowhere near the kingdom with this madness right here, man. This is madness right there. That's madness right there. And because he want to wear a wig now and call himself Rachel, we supposed to look at him and perceive him as a woman. A woman. That's where we at with it right now. <laughs> I seen this shit. I seen it first, and I was already in, in, uh, inspired to do something, do a lesson. Then, then I get an uh, uh, um. Right after I see it, somebody else sends me a, a um. Send me the article. I'm like, yeah, that's the most high telling me, yeah, that this one, speak on this one, um, Sharon. This Revelation 21 and 8. But the fearful and the unbelieving and the abominable and the murderers and the whoremongers and the sorcerers and the idolaters and all liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. See? This is what they getting, man. This is what, no matter how they try to spin it and sell it to us as, um, you know what I mean? As we got, we doing this, we doing that, or whatever. It, it don't matter. It don't matter. According to the scriptures, this what they going to get. Let's keep going. We got a couple more. We got a couple more. Let's go. Jude 1 to 7. It's the book of Jude, chapter 1, verse 7. Even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in all like manner, giving themselves over to fornication and going at the strange flesh, are set forth as an example, suffering the vengeance of the eternal fire. See? See? This is, this is what's coming. Likewise, also, these filthy dreamers defile the flesh despise dominion, and speak evil of dignities. Yep, this is what's coming for them, man. Look down, look down. 
I could probably get some more jewel. We gonna keep going though. Book of Leviticus. Let's go to Leviticus. 20 and 13. The book of Leviticus, chapter 20 and 13. If a man also lie with mankind as he lie with a woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be put to death. Their blood shall be upon them. See? See? I was just looking. Let's keep going. Let's just go. Let's, where we going next? Ephesians. That was where we was at next. This Ephesians chapter 5 verse 11. And have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of the darkness, but rather reprove them. Yeah, so that's what we got to do, man. We got to come out and reprove this bull crap, man. You got this right here, man. And so you'll have a kid that don't know and it'll be calling this she, ma'am, her, and all of this. It's crazy, man. That's crazy, man. Ephesians 5 and 15. See that ye walk, ye walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise, redeeming the time because the days are evil. Yeah, these days are very evil, man. Very evil. We got two more we're going to get out of here. Let's go back to Leviticus 18 and 22. Leviticus 18 and 22. Thou shalt not lie with mankind as with womankind. It is an abomination. See? See? And this is the leader, man. This is one of the leaders. This is the this is the health leader. <laughs> this is the health leader right here for the nation. Fucking madness, man. Straight madness. But then I get you to this one, and we're gonna close out over here. Watch, we're gonna get right here. We're gonna go to 2nd Thessalonians 2. And we're gonna start at 3. Let no man deceive you by any means, for that the day shall not come, except there come a falling away first, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. The man of sin is being revealed, man. The man of sin. This right here is nothing but a walking sin ball. <laughs> a sin ball. <laughs> That's a walking sin ball right there. Let's go. Let's keep going down. Eight. Second Thessalonians 2 and 8. And then shall that wicked be revealed whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth and shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. Yeah, it's coming for them, man. Destruction is coming to Babylon, man. Destruction is coming to Babylon. Oh, let's let's get this one. I, I I mentioned it. Let's get this one over here. Just popped in my head. Revelation 18. Let's go Revelation 18 and 3. For all nations have drunk of the wine of the wrath of her fornication. And the kings of the earth have committed fornication with her. And the merchants of the earth are wax rich through the abundance of her delicacies. And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people, that ye be not partakers of her sins, and that ye receive not of her plagues. For her sins have reached unto heaven, and the Most High hath remembered her inequities. Reward her even as she rewarded you, and double unto her double according to her works in the cup which she hath filled, filled to her double. See? So this is what's coming to this man, this wicked ass place, man, with this right here, man. This this is what's coming, man. These, these is our leaders, man. This this these is our leaders, man. A ball of confusion, man. The highest ranking openly transgender official. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. This is crazy. One more popped in my head. Why, why is I was there doing that? 
you know it Isaiah chapter 30 verse 1 Woe to the rebellious children, saith the Lord, that take counsel, that take counsel, but not of me, and that cover me, that cover with the covering, but not of my spirit, that they may add sin to sin, that walk to go down, <laughs> that walk to go down into Egypt. And have not asked at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh and to, to trust in the shadow of Egypt. So you're going down and ask this guy, you're going to this guy right here to trust him and get your health advice. And he's going to tell you, or she, whatever, whatever this is, going to tell you what you need to be doing health-wise. <laughs> Word. Look, look, Isaiah 31 and 2. No, let's start at 1. Woe to them that go down to Egypt for help and stay on horses and trust in chariots because they are many and in horsemen because they are very strong, but they look not unto the Holy One of Israel, neither seek the Lord. Yet he also is wise and will bring evil and will not call back his words but will arise against the house of the evildoers and against the help of them that work inequity. Yep, this was coming, man. Destruction, man. This place wicked as hell, man. Wicked as hell, man. And I tell you, I'm tired of seeing this type of stuff, man. It's ridiculous, man. But yeah, I'm going to get out of here. And with that one, we're going to say all praises due to the Most High Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rekahakwadash, Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike to a speckled bird. You know, greetings, salutations, you know, keep watching, keep fighting. To the women, to the remnant, men, women, children, remain spiritual. Shalom, Israel, Kwam Yashirala, and the Baba Ba. Barakatham.